Hello dear friends, this is Hello Hollywood, that means you're in for some exciting news. Let's get started. Meghan Markle and Prince Harry made a rare public appearance all the way down in Jamaica, hitting up the premiere for the new Bob Marley movie which is interesting. The Duke and Duchess of Sussex flew down to Kingston Tuesday night where they were in attendance to watch the biopic about the late singer and yes, they were dressed to the nines and smiling from ear to ear looking pretty dang happy to be there. Like we said, the royal couple doesn't really get out all that much, so the fact they surfaced for this film specifically perhaps speaks to a couple different things, assuming you want to read into it. For starters, it's worth noting Jamaica as a nation, of late, has made it clear it wants to step out from under the British monarchy and become an independent republic, similar to Barbados, which broke off on its own in recent years. In fact, the Jamaican PM has spoken on this firmly to none other than Prince William and Kate Middleton during a tour of the country in 2020. 22. That's why the Prime Minister's presence at the premiere was also eye-popping, especially since Meg and Harry posed with him and appeared chummy. It makes you rub your chin. Considering their own history, you'd figure Meghan Markle and Prince Harry are in alignment with what Jamaica wants. So them standing shoulder to shoulder with Andrew Holness speaks volumes. The other element here is the fact that this Bob Marley movie is being distributed through Paramount and a head honcho from the studio, Nickelodeon, Prez Brian Robbins, was also there, and he too posed with Meghan and Harry at one point during Arrivals. We know these two are in search of new opportunities in showbiz after taking some lumps last year, and this almost seems like they're cozying up to the star crew. It's that or they could just be huge Marley fans, hard to say. In any case, Meg and Harry were enjoying themselves even though they technically have nothing to do with this flick. Maybe this is the first sign of their redemption song in the biz, not to stir anything up of course. That's all dear friends, share this video and leave your comments, bye bye.